What type of rock is this? I wonder if it tastes good. What in the world? Why is he licking the ground? This is so awkward. Hello everybody, it's Yami and welcome to a Gatch Life mini movie called The Boy From Space. This one has been made by Moonlight Vids. I'm going to leave a link in the description for their channel so do make sure to go over there and show some love. I'm really excited for this one because I want to find out more about this space boy and how he came to Earth. So let's get right into the gacha. Give me my phone, I need it. What for? You don't have any friends to text. You don't know that. Oh yeah, I forgot you have a sick boyfriend who can leave his house who lives miles away. It's true, he is real. When you finally meet him in person, you'll realize he's just a creepy old man and how no one even really likes you. Wow, this boy is super rude. I hope her phone's not broken. And most importantly, I hope her feelings aren't hurt. It's broken! How am I going to talk to him now? This is the only way I could talk to him. You're hopeless. Your online boyfriend doesn't exist. He does. I know it. What are these girls up to on their phones? They're pulling all sorts of crazy faces. Move! You're in our TikTok. I'm trying to be famous. Oh my goodness, yes. Run away from the crazy TikTok girls. Well, she's not had a very good day, has she? I feel really bad for her. Her phone got broken and then she got shouted at by a bunch of crazy TikTokers. Oh my goodness, what's going on here? Here we go again. Jim, you have to wake up. You have to go to work. What time is it? Time for you to go to work, unless you want us to be homeless. You do it. I'm going back to sleep. I can't go to work for you. I'm literally 17. You have to get up. Oh my goodness, she's having to drag him. Now, where is that laptop? Oh, she's trying to find the laptop because she wants to talk to her online boyfriend. She's not answering any of my messages. What if she forgot about me? How could she forget about you? You talk to each other every day. Then why isn't she responding? You should calm down and control your emotions. You know nothing about emotions. You're a robot. Shut up. She's calling. Hi, Elena. Is something wrong? Everything's fine. Is something wrong with you? I just can't wait until I'm 18 so I can run away and be free. I wish I could come with you. But you can. I've told you that a million times. But I can't, remember? Because of my disease. I can't leave my house. Won't your dad be unhappy if you ran away? I don't know who my dad is. I'm adopted, remember? Adopted? I still don't understand what that means. I just wish we could meet. But I live in space and you live on Earth, which is 169 million miles away. That is a lot of miles. I don't know how this is gonna work out. 169 million? Jeez. Well, I have to go. Bye. Okay, I didn't even get to say bye back. Were you just talking to someone on there? Someone from Earth? No, I was just watching a movie like always. You know if people find out about you, everyone would go crazy. You're basically an alien since you've never been to Earth. I know, I'm alone. Don't worry about it. I'll leave you here to go to sleep. I wonder why he's never been to Earth and why he's living in space right now. Oh, well, he didn't sleep very long. Okay, this is a crazy looking spaceship. What is going on? Oh, what is he doing? He's looking at some pictures. Hi, mom. I've never met you. You, but I miss you. It's my fault you're gone. Wait a second. Is that my dad? Sir, I think it's time we send the boy back to Earth. Keeping him here is like keeping him in a cage. He needs to live a normal life. I'm afraid we cannot do that. It's too risky. Why not? Because of what people would think? This is a person we're talking about. A teenage boy. He's missing out on everything. Sir, it's not your choice anymore. The right thing would be to bring the boy here. NASA has agreed on that. Prepare to bring Grayson to Earth. Guess what? What? Are you actually an alien living in outer space? Awkward. Very awkward because she's kind of spot on. <laughs> I'm kidding. No, they might have found a cure for my disease. Then I'll be able to come outside and I'll come and meet you for the first time. You're kidding. You have to stop joking around. No, it's true. You need to believe me. How long will it take? I'll be here waiting. A few months. If things take too long, it could be at least a year. To even be able to send you to Earth, there's going to be some things you have to go through. There are surgeries that we have to do on you. And 
and a lot of physical training. You weigh a lot more on Earth than you do here. I'm ready. I'll do whatever it takes. Five months later. Oh my goodness. I think he's had all of his surgery and he's ready to come to Earth. Why is it so bright? It's because of the sun. You'll need to wear these glasses to protect your eyes. Can I go now? What do you mean? You can't leave, you know that. You have to run a few more tests to make sure that you're fine. And if your body doesn't react well to being on Earth, then we'll have to send you back. But I feel fine. I feel great. Oh no, he's wobbling all over the place. Really doesn't look like he's feeling great. Why does my body feel so heavy? Because of gravity, remember? Oh yeah, this stuff is new to me. Just take a seat. They'll be back to do more tests. What is he doing? He's running. Why has the alarm gone off? It's the boy, sir. He's escaped. No, we need to get him back before the media spots him. Then it'll be on every magazine cover. We can't let that happen. Your boy is making a run for it. He wants to meet his online girlfriend. He's putting on some clothes and he's getting ready to see her. I don't blame him. He's been like an experiment his entire life. I'd probably break out if I was him too. What type of rock is this? I wonder if it tastes good. What in the world? Why is he licking the ground? This is so awkward. Get out of this street. Are you dumb? What? It's me. I told you I'd come see you after they found a cure for my disease. You didn't text me back or FaceTime me for five months. Well, I had to get here and it takes a long time. Where did you say you were from again? N New York. I'm from New York. So it took you five months to get from New York to California. Actually, I came from Mars, but okay. Oh, she is mad. She doesn't even want to talk to him. Wait for me. What is this place? It's a school. You probably wouldn't know because it seems like you've never been to one. Do you not know anything? Stay right here. I have to go to science. I'll be back. Oh my goodness, he's fallen asleep, stood up. <laughs> what is he doing? She's taking forever. I can't wait any longer. I'm going to go in. This is just a terrible idea. I don't know what he's playing at. But it's his first day on Earth and he's going into science class after his online girlfriend who's in a mood with him. She's in the middle of her lesson, dude. What are you doing? Hi, are you new here? Huh? Are you a foreign exchange student? Can you understand English? Are you a foreign exchange student? Can you understand English? Just take a seat. Now, let's see who did their homework. Who was Albert Einstein? He discovered America. That was a literal face palm because that answer was so stupid. <laughs> oh, this guy. No, Albert Einstein created the theory that light bends. Is he dumb? I've never used the word dumb before. What's the correct term for bending light? Oh, that's easy. It's called refraction. You didn't tell me that you were smart. I like science. I was raised by scientists on a spaceship. Why are you looking at me like that? Because how can you be smart and stupid at the same time? I didn't expect you to be this mean. And I didn't expect you to be so different. Where are you really from? Why is she so rude to him? He's just trying his best. Honestly, I'm from space. Now I know you're crazy for sure. Did he seriously expect her to believe that? Oh yeah, I'm from space, totally. I came on a spaceship and I live on Mars. She was never gonna believe that, was she? That sounds like a lie. It sounds like he's made it up. Oh no, now it's raining. Her hair's gone all strange. Is that water falling from the sky? Is this rain? Okay, you might not be lying. You see this photo? This is my dad. I need you to help me find him. Where does he live? The back of this photo says Mexico. Where is your mom? She was an astronaut. She died giving birth to me because we were in outer space. I'm the reason she's gone. But they said she died on the trip from Earth to there. They lied. Okay, wait right here. I have to get a few things like money and stuff. Money? I've never seen that before. Oh my goodness, they're gonna catch him. Oh no. Grayson, we need you to come with us. You don't know the danger you're in. I don't want to go back. They'll just probe me like some science experiment. I know you want to be normal, but you just aren't human, even though you may look like it. Wait, if he's not human? What is he? Your body reacts differently to being on Earth. Elena is stealing him. Run, follow me. Quick guys, you gotta go. Oh no, he's gonna get caught. This is terrible. Are you okay? It's the gravity. My body still isn't used to it. We won't make it there walking. We'll need a car. Great. 
Do you have one? No, we'll just steal someone else's. Oh my gosh, they're about to commit a crime. This is actually the worst. They might end up getting arrested and then all of this would have been for nothing. Isn't that stealing? So you know what stealing is, but you don't know what a street is. Oh, they are being chased. Where did they go? Come on, get in. But it's not ours. Fine, I'll leave you then. Oh, she's off. She really did just leave him. Okay, I've changed my mind. There's only one bed. You can take it if you want. I was going to make you sleep on the floor anyways. Oh wow, she really just did him dirty like that. Why do you keep looking at me? Go to sleep. You're so beautiful. You can't just say that. Why not? Because regular people don't say what they're feeling. You have to keep everything to yourself. It's not like I'm going to tell you that I like being with you and I don't want you to. You just did. Oh my goodness, the doctor has arrived with the biggest needle I have ever seen in my life. And that is my worst nightmare. Grayson's vitals are unbelievably low. If we don't get him back up on that spaceship, he won't last much longer. What exactly is the problem? His heart is too big. It will continue to grow and eventually it will stop working. Wait a second, so Grayson might die? This is super serious. This is all my fault. What are you talking about? If I wasn't so worried about the media finding out that there was a baby born in space, then we could have sent him back long ago. That's the real reason I need to get him. If he dies, it's on me. Are you ready? Your nose, it's bleeding and you look sick. What's going on? I think it's the heart problem. Oh my goodness, poor guy. I'm fine. We have to get you to a hospital. They can't fix me. There's no cure for me but to go back. And I'm not going back until I find my father. Is this the one? It's the only house here, so it has to be the one. Who are you people? You see this photo? It's my mom. And I think you're my dad. That's my wife. She died on a space mission. She didn't make the trip. But I have no idea who you are. Well, that's not true. She died nine months after making the trip because she had given birth to me. I don't know who you are, but this isn't funny. It's not okay to make these kinds of jokes. Are you blind? He literally looks just like you. He came all the way from space to Earth just to find you. So I suggest you stop being a jerk. Oh no, he's collapsed. Grayson? Then he died. Oh God, no he didn't. <laughs> Thank goodness, I thought he really died then. Don't get up. You're still not fully recovered. Where's Elena? Get out. But I have to watch over you. That was an order. Where are you? I'm on Earth. But don't worry, I'm coming there soon. You're coming here? To space? Yeah, I'm training to be an astronaut. My heart, oh my goodness, she's doing that for him. How oh, sweet. Oh, it's just too sweet. We'll meet again soon. And guys, that is where today's Gacha story has ended. I really hope you did enjoy it. And if you did, remember to leave a like. And if you want to watch another video of mine, you can click here and let's go watch it together.